Good morning, good afternoon and good evening everyone. So today I got Redmi Note 10 and uh, highly request was coming to make a video of flashing how to flash the uh, Android 13 the Evolution X ROM on Redmi Note 10. I have already flashed this ROM and believe me the ROM is very good performing best on Redmi Note 10 and uh, plus point is that we are getting Android 13 after flashing the Evolution X ROM on Redmi Note 10 and this ROM can be flashed on any variant of Redmi Note 10 but you must have an unlock bootloader now if you don't know how to unlock the bootloader and if you want to flash the uh, the fastest ROM of Evolution X on Redmi Note 10 then you need to watch the video tutorial video how to unlock the bootloader and then you can simply follow the follow the steps to flash the Android 13 Evolution X ROM on Redmi Note 10. Now the tutorial video link is provided in my video description. Now if you ask that uh, how this ROM is performing if we want to use as a daily base or as a daily driver yes this is the ROM that you can use for daily basis and we are getting uh, extraordinary modification section in this ROM you can modify your ROM the way you like and also the benchmark score if you can see on your screen now starting the procedure of how to flash the evolution X Android 13 ROM on Redmi Note 10 now before starting the procedure this is the request that uh, subscribe my channel by tapping the red color subscribe button and also click the bell icon tap the select all thank you so much must save all your mobile phone internal storage data this uh, procedure will wash everything check the battery should be charged minimum to 50 to 60 percent now go to settings if you have uh, turned on the lock screen password then go to password security and turn off the lock screen password then in case if you are using me account sync your me account once and then remove it go to account sync sync your google account once and then remove it the redmi note 10 of any variant must have android version 12 it doesn't matter if uh, the set is uh, having miui version 13.0.9 or 13.0.10 currently my set is on updated rom the miui 13.0.10 but redmi note 10 must have android version 12 to get this android 13 evolution x rom work work on redmi note 10 now if you have done all these things you can simply power off the mobile phone and this procedure requires data cable and also computer now moving towards my computer screen i have provided all the links in my video description just uh, simply uh, make a new folder and download these two files the orange fox recovery and the evolution x rom for redmi note 10 first extract the orange fox recovery in same folder then double click the extracted folder of recovery and you will see bunch of files here coming back towards my mobile phone mobile phone must be power off and mobile phone boot loader must be unlocked we need to boot the set into fast boot mode for that hold the mobile phone in your left hand check the other side of this cable must be connected with computer hold the data cable in your right hand press and hold the volume down key and connect the cable in few seconds the set will boot into fast boot mode then release the volume down key immediately the set is booted and also connected with my computer coming back towards my computer screen first i will go to device manager and i will show that the set is booted into fast boot mode connected with computer and windows detected the drivers and also detected the set this is the android bootloader interface driver which you must see on your device manager now i will close this window coming back towards my extracted folder of my computer uh, double click the flash one file the uh, recovery flashing will get started it will window will get clo auto close after flashing done now double click the flash to file the set will get reboot immediately press and hold the volume up key and uh, when custom recovery screen appears then release the volume up key here we go i have released the volume up key custom recovery screen appears on my mobile phone so the recovery screen booted but the internal storage did not pop up on my computer screen which means that the storage is got encrypted we have to decrypt uh, the storage first for that tap 
not the first not the second the third menu on the computer on the mobile phone screen and then tap the format data type y e s here then tap here and when it is done then go back to the main screen tap the last menu then tap reboot and tap recovery so the mobile phone is got uh, booted back into customer recovery and this time we got uh, the internal storage on computer screen but still the internal storage is not in proper form which means that we cannot copy and paste on the internal storage so we have to do one more thing and for that just concentrate here tap the arrow key the up arrow key uh, once then if, if you can see that data folder is over here tap the data folder to open the data folder and then here tap the three dots button here then tap create folder and type m e d i a media must type and must create a folder with the name of media then tap here media folder is created tap the media folder to open the folder and then again tap the three dots here then cre uh, tap create folder and type any name you want i will go for t e c h tag and tap here the tag folder also created now tap the last menu here and tap reboot then tap recovery let the set boot into custom recovery once again so we got the set boot back into custom recovery and this time we can see that the internal storage appears once again on computer screen and this time we got the internal storage in proper form we can copy paste any files here now come to the come back to the computer screen we are still in extracted folder of recovery come down here and copy the orange fox recovery you can see that here in zip format copy from the computer hard drive and then double click the internal storage and paste that file in internal storage of mobile phone now when it is done then come to the uh, mobile phone screen tap the second menu and then tap back to the first menu you will see the orange fox recovery file here tap the file and then swipe to flash the recovery once again so the recovery will get flashed properly and when it is done then go back to the main screen of uh, the recovery tap the last menu again here tap reboot and tap recovery let the set boot back into custom recovery once again Finally, the mobile phone booted back into custom recovery and we can see the internal storage pop up once again on computer screen. I will go to my computer hard drive and I will go back to my downloaded folder and I will copy the ROM file of, from the downloaded folder of the computer hard drive and then I will paste that file in my uh, mobile phone internal storage. I will click double click the internal storage and paste that file over here so after when file uh, got copied then disconnect the cable from mobile phone and we are done from the computer and i will come back to my mobile phone screen so we will start the flashing of custom rom now tap the not the first not the second and the third menu the tap the third menu and then select the Dalvik Art Cache first, then Meta Data and Data. That's all. These three partitions need to be select and then swipe. When it is done, then come back to repeat this procedure once again. Now go back and then tap the first menu and you will see the Evolution X ROM over here tap to select the rom file and then swipe to start flushing the flushing will uh, will get start and it will take a time just wait for it now finally flushing got completed and uh, just go back to the main screen then tap the last menu here and tap reboot then tap system now just wait for it the set will boot it will get reboot and it will start booting into evolution x rom the android 13 rom the first boot will not take that much time so just wait for it 
when first boot complete then i will continue well first boot uh, didn't took that much time the welcome screen appears so complete the setup screen now so we got the rom flashed perfectly let me show the about phone of my mobile phone so we got the evolution x rom the android version 13 and the android security update if you can see that october 5th october 2022 the latest security update the baseband must see the numbers below baseband and one more thing that this rom comes without the camera application so you after uh, logging in your google account you can simply go to play store and download any the third party camera application and also the google camera application available the official google camera uh, application on play store you can simply download that and start using it so like the video if you uh, think that you got helped by this video thank you so much take a good care of yourself we'll see you in next video until then goodbye